Welcome back to Tech Nuggets. This is part 3 of Tailwind CSS video series. In this video, we will see how do we create various types of alerts. So alerts are integral part of any of the uh, system design. Uh, it is going to give you a warning, success, error, whatever, right? So in this video, we will see um, uh, various kinds of alerts such as left accented, right accented, titled, with badges, and top accented. Okay, anyway, before we get into this video, quick channel analytics. There are a lot of views are happening on this channel. However, there is a small percentage of viewers or subscribed. So, if you are not subscribed yet, Please scroll down and hit the subscribe button now and follow me on Twitter. Okay, let's get started. Okay, let's go ahead and create some alerts, right? First thing, let's make a small heading. Say alerts and um, would you like to put HR horizontal line? Okay. How does it look? Alerts. Uh, nice subheading. Even if you look at HR, does not have or it has its own style. You need to add some classes and borders. Okay. Let's go ahead and create a first alert that is a left accented alert. okay so the first thing what you notice here um, bg background color orange border l the left accent is created with border l so what do you mean by that left is left is highlighted with one side bordered right then border orange with various shades and adding four the main, main important part here is the role of this div is alert that's how it differentiates and this can be used for warnings so here i'm going a sample message server taking too long to respond let's see how does it look turn it awesome so you created a first alert with a warning message server taking server taking too long to respond okay so imagine you wanted to create a successful message with the green color so how do we do that say i wanted to put here as a right accented okay So here, if you see L left, here I made it right, and uh, background color PG green 200 with a border green 500 and text green 700, adding for roll alert on board success. Right? Let's see this how it looks. Awesome! So you created a successful alert the previous one was a warning alert and right hand side you can notice this one is a right accented the previous one was left accented with the warning okay now let's go ahead and create this is good looking good how do i say i want to create a titled alert something traditional where it has a title bar and the message let's go ahead and create that So as usual div roll alert and uh, this is a combination of two divs okay so title we are using as a div um, itself and uh, the color with the red 
font and again uh, adding x and y 4 and 2 and this is a rounded okay and for the message another div that's a border t 0 okay that's a top 0 and uh, border red 400 rounded and again um, padding x and y 4 and 3 text red say this kind of error message usually use like something critical say I am using it as like 404 page not found something like that uh, how does it look like awesome so yeah error with a rounded message error 404 page not found okay this is another alert so we are we are given warning success error all three we are given now let's move on to a little bit more advanced kind of warnings where it has got some um, badges internally right okay say how do we do that Go ahead and create this. So this is with bash. Um again this is combination of two divs with spans. Okay. So one is uh, the color is indigo. And see I am saying large and px4. And then you have uh, color indigo item centered text indigo surrounded full flex inline flex and roll is alert this one okay and inside that you have new and there is a um this i am using as a new log message available for analysis this can be used for anything for example if there is a in a typical e-commerce site or any other site you have any new offer probably you can say there is a new product available that kind of um, situation let's see how it looks let's go ahead and see the screen awesome so it, it's, it's a nice looking screen and nice looking alert message let's so this is one and uh, finally what if I want to create some something with icon much more advanced than this so again I will use uh, SVG here um, if you needed you can use images okay So uh, if you look at it again, this is a combination of three divs and uh, inside that we have SVG, right? Okay. So you see this SVG class fill and this is the one, this is the shape what we have, SVG path. That's what it is going to create icon on. So we just giving as a welcome to technology make sure subscribe to my channel it's a kind of message anyway let's see how it looks this usually kind of uh, informational message it can be a successful uh, info kind of messages let's see how it looks awesome so you have this this is the svg which i talked about and just put the message what we'd like to have so this is about alerts um thank you for watching so please subscribe and uh, follow me on twitter thank you let me see you on other videos